Hello, since we've done our heated paint bed, we can uh, go mass production with part, but uh, it's it would be much easier to print many parts at once. So I've tried to find out some method to do, and I found the blender is good tool to make multiple parts print. So at first we found some parts. I think we can go with bed spring. We need four of them. So open blender. File import STL. Found bundle kit. Okay, here we go. Bed spring for off STL. Import. Here you can see it's our spring and the other part, maybe X bar clamp M4. So again, file import STL. Import STL, so here we go, and maybe X bar clamp M4. I'm looking for import. So now, what we need to do is to place the parts. So we need four springs and then duplicate 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 six of these Four of these. So now we need to connect all these parts into one STL. I found the easiest way is to edit the cube which sits in every new file in Blender. We will make it thin 0 0.05 and we can make it 17 centimeters both directions so we can see the print area of printer. Yeah, there can be a lot more parts, but I think that that's enough. Don't, don't know. Now we have to move hmm. the parts into one place. Doesn't matter how precise you are. the parts are closer means the print had 
don't have to travel long distances between them. I think this is just fine. So now make sure that the original cube sits on top. That means we have to change this to to five. Now it sits just on top of this. And we have to make sure that all the parts are sit sits on the top of the file. You can see it. I think that all are good. Now we can, we have to select all parts, join a bit objects. Okay, now we have, all you have to do now is to export STL. We can Name Mendel back dot blend oh dot stl export stl now we can check it out it's Mendel back here you can see all parts one STL. Now it remains to go through the skin forge. Make sure the multiply is turned off. Okay, so 